Oh, here's the sink. The fucking web, you know, the mic that thing again where it's like, I'm just going to delete myself. Huh? I love when that happens. Huh? So I had to reset all the sync stuff. Not all synced? Okay. Just love it when just stuff just deletes. Great time. Any better? Let's have everything completely reset again. It's gonna be one of these ones where they do it like fucking five times or something. Oh, good. Nice. Okay, so we are currently in Kiryu's storyline. And we had just met, oh fuck, all the names have escaped my head. The guy who'd escaped prison with Saijima. The guy from Yakuza 3. Names escaping me. We were with him. He had come to see Kiryu. Then we met Saijima's sister. Um, and the three of us were all together in, in Okinawa and she had come down to Okinawa to meet Saijima. Saijima had already gone and then your guy gave himself up to the police so we could escape. Frogman, yeah. No, not Frogman, that's Shimano. Huh? He died in the first game. Frog, he's a froggy man anyway. Like, uh... So now Kiryu and your girl whose name starts with a Y, which I can't remember, are heading back up to Kamurocho, I think, while your guy's giving himself up to let us go. Several frogmen and Yakuza. Ah, that's not false. <laughs> Chapter 2, two Kamarucho. Let's go. Let us be off. Huh? I'm back to Tanimura. Right. Leaving already, Machan. That's right, the fucking, his like, op superior officer was like, dirty, whatever. That's the chief on the left, and then that's your guy, Suguchi. The guy died last time. You know, Zao-san, you've been a better friend to me than I've ever been to you. Don't be ridiculous. You know that's not true. I'm just sorry the truth turned out to be so harsh. Your father, murdered by another man in the force. I can barely believe it. You're telling me. Something about all this doesn't sit well with me. How will your father's spirit ever find peace? I think it'll be just fine. Huh? Chief Hisai, Suguchi san. They were tired of being used by Minokata and Katsuragi all these years. That's the boys from the Ueno Sewa. Anytime we see names pop up again, and everyone needs a refresher, so anytime I see the names, I'll be like, that's, that was this, that was this. So yeah, uh, Chief Hisai was like. Tanimura's boss. Suguchi is the cop who has kind of been like in a couple of different stories so far. In Yakuza 4, he's the one. He was in Akiyama's story and he's also in this. And it turns out he was like a sleeper agent within the force for the um, Ueno Sewa. Um, he's, he's the one who he he killed um, Tanimura's like adoptive dad. Uh, Suguchi died last. Uh, last one. And then um, Katsuragi is like the main. Kind of the main villain of this one. Um. Mm. He's the Ueno Sewa guy who's he's not the boss of the Ueno Sewa, but he's like the second in command who like orchestrated the hit that um remember the big the big hit that Saijima did where he went around and shot all the boys and then they didn't end, they didn't even die. It was uh, that guy then who went around and just like fucking killed all his own boys then. Um. Saijima. Saijima was technically innocent, he didn't kill anyone. But he went to prison for it while your guy killed him all. The two then spent their whole lives serving others, but their final moments. 
Those were theirs, and theirs alone. They went out following their own brand of justice. Machan. So Gucci Sam must have known telling me the truth of what happened 25 years ago with signing his own death warrant. But he did it anyway. And Chief Isai, he took his own life in order to spare you, me, and Mei Hua. That explains what he said into the phone before he shot himself. Both of them will be dealt with. Yeah. Chief Isai told Munakata I was dead so he'd stop coming after me. I don't, I don't even know if we saw the Chief kill himself. And it was multiple weeks sooner, I like, but... He spared my life so that I could do what's right. So that I could do what he never could. You mean bring Munakata down? Exactly. But how are you going to do that, Machan? Minakata is one of the most powerful men and one of the top police institutions in the world. Oh yeah, so Minakata is... That's right. So Minakata is like the... The head of the force? Or he's like one of the top boys. Uh, and in the flashback, we saw Suguchi... Like, you saw him bring Suguchi in and... Minakata basically knew that Suguchi was like a sleeper agent. For the end of the he's like, he's like, you know, cut me in, hey, and I'll not, I'll not rat you out. That's right. Duckhead, hi. Hello, Feral. That wasn't aimed at you. <laughs> How you doing, boss? Well, I don't think I'll be getting much help from my fellow officer, that's for sure. Who's here? Yeah. Hey, Akiyama. Ni hao. Akiyama-san. <laughs> hey. The shit's really hit the proverbial fan, huh? You're telling me. Anyway, what's up? You wouldn't swing by here without a good reason. Mm. You know, sometimes it's depressing how sharp you are. What happened? What happened? District Attorney's good and showed up in my office. Started tearing the place apart at the seams. Not to mention, they chucked me out on the street. Wait, they're investigating Sky Finance? Yakuza time, huh? Majima's birthday today as well. In Japan, but still. On what grounds? They said they're looking into some kind of coercion. The exact terms eluding me at the moment. Anyway, the issue is my tests. They said I'm forcing people to do stuff they don't want to do in exchange for money. Classic coercion case, I guess. <laughs> like I can hear the words coming out of the DA's mouth himself. Anyway, I don't know where else to turn, so I thought I'd drop by here. Doing okay, probably, yeah. Go out this weekend, like, not really done much this week, because I've been off sick with COVID. But, I said it's Friday. I used to have some yakas at the time. Um, how are you doing, boss? Hey, how was your Friday? Looks like I caught you at a bad time, though. Want me to come back later? No, your timing actually couldn't be better. Oh, yeah? Yeah. I need a ham or something, Akiyama-san. Oh, he's gonna get Akiyama's help to go after the fucking police chief. Let's go. Oh, is this Kiryu? Let's go. March 13th, 5 p.m. Kiryu-san. <laughs> Fuzz everywhere. <laughs> We saw back. Watch Firefly stream today. It was lovely to see everyone. That's great. Time. Can't think of a better place to talk than New Serena. Yasuko was her name. Yasuko san. There's a bar near here that I used to go to back in the day. We can catch our breath there for a bit. Isn't Serena like gone? <laughs> okay, I'll follow your lead. It like, wasn't it in the same location where Sky Finance was. <laughs> What's this truck doing here? Is someone moving? No time to waste. Gotta get to New Serena. Oh, he wants to actually take the... Oh, the sign's still there. Okay. No, it's still here. Maybe Sky Finance is just on a different floor or something. I could have sworn it was in the same location, though. Uh, yes, sir. That my man's Date, hey! What, what a man, hun. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> What's going on, Kitty? 
You show up in a guy's bar and don't even drop him a line first. That's right, didn't like Date like this but like, this bar was closed in Yakuza 3 and Date like uh took it over as like a safe house in Yakuza 3. One person got it? Nice. I need to grab it myself actually. Do you drop my line first? Sorry for not letting you know that, Hassan. I have some business in town. Work never ends for the X Fourth Chairman, huh? You got that right. Anyway, this is Yasuko Saijima. I'm here helping her with a little something. It's nice to meet you. Oh, the pleasure's all mine. She's a knockout kid, you. How'd you end up bringing a girl like her back here, huh? Whatever you're thinking, I guarantee you've got the wrong idea. Let's leave it at that. By the way, where's Mama? Gone for the week. Family trouble, you know how it goes. And you're holding down the fort while she's gone? Yep. It's a real pain, all with my other work and all. But she insists we keep it open for the regulars. Talking for us that she does. Hi, right, kitty. What's this little something you need to take care of? Oh, right. You mind taking a seat, Yasuko-san? Um, please. I just need to ask you something before we head out to find your brother. Okay. So what does he need to ask me? Sorry if this is a blunt question. But why do you need to see your brother so bad? Bad enough to murder for it? That's right, she's killing all them boys, huh? Wait, you what? Kitty san is this really the best place to... Don't worry about Date-san. He's an ex-detective, yeah. But we can trust him. I promise. Date's a fucking G, hey? Huh? He'd never turn you in without hearing what you had to say first. Isn't that right, Date-san? Well, uh... Yeah, that's right. Date's rule of thumb is he has to show up in a helicopter in every game he's on, huh? And we saw him in a helicopter in the intro, so we know what's gonna happen. <laughs> now tell me the truth, Yasuko-san. Why would you go so far for your brother? I... Yasuko-san. Come on! It's because... Because Taiga is everything to me. I owe him my life. What? I'm serious. If it weren't for him, I would have died years ago. Go on. Have you ever heard of a living donor kidney transplant? Oh yeah, you read about those things all the time. That's when they give you a kidney from one of your relatives, right? They say you only need one after all. Right. The truth of it is, I'm the recipient of one of those living donor transplants. And your brother's the one who gave it to you, huh? That's what you meant when you said him, you owe him your life? Yes. Hold on. Getting a transplant like that from your sibling isn't all that uncommon. I'm not judging or anything, but do you really owe him that much just for a kidney? No worries. It's not that simple. Think you can explain? The kidney I got, it wasn't Tiger's. He wasn't the match. Go on. Is Majima involved in some way? What? Different blood types? Well, yes, but... But what? Why couldn't you get the transplant from your brother? Yasuko-san. I... Um... I think I get what's going on here. You and Taiga aren't actually siblings. Get you! He's right. Taiga is my stepfather's son from his prior marriage. My mother had held, huh? my mother had me before she and my stepfather ever even met. And where'd you find a match? Since my mother had already passed, Tiger tracked down my biological father and begged him to donate his kidney to me. Begged him? I? Saijima. Beyond the regular difficulty of finding a kidney donor, my blood type is extremely rare. A direct relative was my only hope of a match. Once Tiger learned that, he spent every waking moment of his life scouring the city until he found my father. He was only 15 years old at the time. Still just a kid, huh? I had honestly given up hope. Before my mother died, she told me my father was nothing more than an abusive drunk with no chance of ever changing. Based on what I knew, it seemed likely he was already dead. Even if he wasn't, I didn't want to live knowing I owed my life to such a horrible man. At the time, I would have rather died than continue on carrying a part of him inside me. But Taiga wouldn't take no for an answer. He said no matter what happened, he would take care of me. Then, he found your dad? Yes. Well, where was he? In Kansai. He had started working for a Yakuza organization called the Omi Alliance. 
Handling the dirty jobs nobody else wanted to touch. Oh, we know them boys from the first two games. The Omi. That's right. Taiga went alone to Kansai, knowing full well that my father was a Yakuza, but... The dirty boys. They had Ryuji though. Ryuji was a dick, but he was fucking... He's an honorable dick, huh? Do we know her dad? We haven't heard his dad, the dad's name yet. Let me guess. They tried to extort him. Exactly. A Yakuza three and three. My father demanded a massive sum of money in exchange for one of his kidneys. How much cash are we talking here? 30 million yen. 30 mil? That's a ton now, but it was a fortune back then. How was a kid ever supposed to get his hands on that kind of money? He wasn't. That was the point. But Taiga didn't give up. He started fighting thugs in the streets of Kamarocho, trying to scrape together whatever funds he could. That would never work. Not for cash like that. It didn't. Not until Sasai-san from the Tojo clan stepped in. He gave Taiga the 30 million under one condition. He joined the Sasai family. So that's how he ended up in the Tojo. All that time, Taiga never turned his back to me. Even when it seemed like all hope was lost, he supported me. He dropped out of high school, gave up on his dream of becoming a teacher, even joined the Yakuza for me. So that's what you meant when you said you owe him your life. That's right. He's everything to me. Not only did Taiga literally save my life, but he gave me the will to keep on living. Yasuko san. Damn. He doesn't. He is. そんなのはどうでもいいんです。私にとってお兄ちゃんはお兄ちゃんだから。あんたにはここで待っていてもらう。少しこの店で頭を冷やした方がいい。何言ってんだ、キリオ。こんなに切実に会いたがってるってのに。安子さん。もし最初めがすでに死んでいたとしたら、あんたどうするつもりだ。死ぬ気なんじゃないのか。え。エクストリーム。Yasuko-san, you keep saying you tiger your life, and I get it. We all rely on other people. It's hard to keep going without someone loving you, supporting you, pushing you onward. But in your case, Taiga became more than that. He's not just your support. He's your reason to keep living. I... I know life hasn't been easy for you. Losing your parents is one of the worst pains imaginable, and you had to bear that burden at a far younger age than most. But having a hard life doesn't exact excuse the way you've lived. Not that I have any right to talk. I've made my fair share of mistakes. Get you. I understand why you feel so strongly, but that emotion has led you to some bad decisions. It's not a stretch to say it's completely clouded your judgment. So, I need you to stay here while I go figure out where your brother is. It's for your own good. But, but, get you. Don't worry, I'll find him. And I'll make sure you two are reunited, I promise. But for now, you just need to be patient, okay? Yes. Thank you. Hmm. Uncle Kaz, eh? Um. Thank you, Yasuko-san. Take care of it for me, will you? Heh. Do you even have to ask? Back up, start him. Stay voice. Or hide it, whatever. Do you not think? Wait until. See if we can come back here. Ah, oh, fuck! Never mind. <laughs> I will go back and save him. We can. Fine, Sajima. Hold on, Sekiru. What's wrong? There's something I need to tell you. Couldn't really say it in there. Does it involve Yasuko-san? You bet. If she finds out about this, she just end up getting herself into more trouble. Well, what is it? Well, you only just got here, so you probably haven't noticed. But the whole town's been kind of on edge lately. And fucking Saijima's crawling around the sewers like a ninja turtle. 
because of Saijima. Partially, I'm sure. But there's more to it than that. Word on the street is, Majima and Saijima linked a few days ago. What? Yep, that's right, they had their whole scrap in the baseball arena. I hear Majima had his boys line the whole damn street to keep the cops off Saijima. Huh. So they've already met. Speaking of, Date-san. Do you know where I can find Majima-san? No worries, bro. I need to talk to him as soon as possible. Not just about Saijima. Majima-san might be able to tell me more about the connection between the top police brass, Jingu, and the Tojo clan. The police? What are you talking about? Hmm. Sorry, but I can't say much more than that. Just know that people are gunning for the Tojo. And no matter what's going down, I need to hear Majima-san's side of the story. Alright. Last I heard, he'd taken root up at the top floor of the Millennium Tower. Starting there is your best bet. Great. Thanks, Date-san. Why the fuck's Majima at the Millennium Tower? Hmm? You got an email. Rematch from four years ago? Kiryu, you come to Yoshida Batting Center? Let's finish what we started four years ago. Four years ago, huh? That could be just about anybody. Guess I'll find out what's about if I drop by Yoshida Batting Center. Do you not think these tabletops look like dirty dishes from Sims? I can't unsee it. Look at them. Fucking disgusting, huh? Komaki here, it's been ages, Kiryu, if you're here in Kamurocha, come see me, I'll be waiting at my dojo in the Dragon Palace. A text from Master Komaki. I wonder if you have one of his apprentices write this. Komaki dojo is inside Dragon Palace on Park Boulevard. I should probably stop by when I have the time. That's our training man, so we saw him in one of the other characters. I kind of want to go to the batting cages and see who he's like, starting me. Ever. Oh, what the fuck's going on in my entire, huh? Uh-oh. Majima, what are you doing? Give him away, NPCs, huh? Uh oh. Majima? Happy birthday! Majima no Nisa. Majima おい、どこ行く当てに動くな何があったんだうまいこと急ぎ焼きるちゃん。全部の事件は繋がっとる。25年前のやつも100億のやつ。ネット Majima prison arc, no! That's not what the man deserves on his birthday. Huh? 
Heartbreak. That was a short chapter. So if you see they're talking about the um the ten billion yen or whatever it was, that was the money from Yakuza One. Remember the kind of like well, I say remember, you might not remember. It's the whole like driving force between behind the, the plot of Yakuza One. It's it's kind of all come back in uh to this. Whenever they mentioned Jingu as well, that was like the uh kind of one of the main antagonists from the first game as well. He was like the politician guy. Chapter three, encounter. Sorry, that crackle was me. Daigo? Meanwhile, at the Tojo clan chairman's office. Why did they get Majima arrested? <sighs> That's the fuck. It's the fucking cop guy, the, the crooked cop guy at the top. This is the guy Tani is trying to get. This fucking guy, huh? The crooked police chief guy. Daigo, what's up, my man? Say. I like Daigo, so I'm giving him the benefit of the doubt. This guy is so He stinks. Mind I go with bleach blonde hair, huh? Fucking what was the guy? Arai, right? Mm -hmm. Fucking coppers, huh? もう迷ってる時間はありませんよ。ペグ。私はね、それは間違いありません。うん。我々警察は目に見える犯罪から一般人を守り秩序を築いた。ウォーティーレフェンス。そして極道は目に見えない外敵を水際で叩き、この国を独立国家として成り立たせる。ドリファーナーさんゲットマ
Sorry about the crackle. Yeah, I don't think Katsuragi-boo-Dan-Kot. So this fucking, this, this police guy, the guy Arai, the guy who's like standing up, and then um, Katsuragi are our three kind of main antagonists this game. Like outside you, ma. It's gonna be Katsuragi, isn't it? Fucking guy, huh? Katsuragi. Oh, the florist's there. No, don't tell me he killed him. He's just knocked out, Copium. なんでお前がここにおるんや。話すのも面倒なくらいいろいろあってね。ま、あんたもいろいろまじまさんから聞かされただろう。お前の目的は何なんや。俺のこと拉致して何になるんや。ま、心配するな。すぐにあんたを殺そうってわけじゃない。あんたにはまだ生きていてもらうよ。どうせ殺すんやったら、早いやれ。この間にまどろっこしいことして、時間使うぐらいやったら、いっそ死んだ方がマシや。うん。ほ
Majima-san said Yasuko-san's in danger. I have a bad feeling about this. Oh, he said it. Better get back to New East Savannah and make sure she's okay. <laughs> Fuck the baseball, let's go! Seems they arrested a Yakuza. Paid track by the look of it. Probably Majima room. What do we like in terms of drinks? Not that good. Cyberpunk Ali. Go, 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 go. Oh shit, where are they, bomb? No! What the? Date san! Date san! Date san! Ugh. Good. Looks like he's coming too. Date san! Huh? Oh, kitty. What happened? What happened? Are you okay? I think so. Guess he just blacked out or something. Fuck. You sure you're okay? My head's still fuzzy as all heck, but yeah. I'll be fine. Do you remember what happened? Well, you and I had that chat outside, and I came back in to keep Yasuko-san company while you were gone. Next thing I knew, I was waking up on the floor to you screaming. Do you remember anything else? She fucking whapped him, didn't she? To escape? Wait, now you mention it. Yasuko-san poured us a couple of drinks when I stepped back in. Or she fucking, she drugged him. Drinks. You think there's a chance she drugged you? Can't rule out the possibility. They're still on the counter if you want to have a sip for yourself. I think I'll pass. Anyway, do you have any idea where Yasuko-san might have gone? Not a clue, sorry. Damn it. Look, I'm sorry. I was ready to throw down if some thugs barged in and tried to take her away. But I didn't think Yasuko-san herself would be the one fighting me. It's not your fault, Tate-san. Guess I should probably get looking for her then. I'll be back. Wait, Kiryu. I'm coming too. No. I need you to stay here in case she comes back. This is probably the safest place in town at this point. Right. Well, good luck out there. Thanks. I'll be back soon. Fucking nightmare. I thought there might have been some, some spare drinks or something. God damn, huh? Oh, this way. New flash everyone's a deck. On Yasku. No way but forward. Gotta get the Yasku down fast. Uh, I get so exhausted when the weather gets bad. Like all this rain just south my energy and ruined my hair. If anyone's seen her. Alright, this guy needs fucking his ass beat. Get your hand off me, scum. I'm ever gonna survive the week if I don't get my hit of that sweet, sweet Megami chan. I'm so stressed I could die. Mm. Alright, uh, wait, is that. Oh, there she is! <laughs> there she is again. Yum! Ay, 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 fuck off. XP.
Cac, cac, cac. Oh, I want to get a fucking heat action. Something to grab. Aha! Oh, the weakest guy as well. No, oh, the bike. Yeah. Fuck it. Aha. Oh, yeah, fucker. Sure, you can. Drinks. Where's she going? Into like the square area. Theater square. Penguin. Damn it. Looks like I lost her. There. Yeah. We're towards Wild Jackson. Just go. She getting in a taxi? Looks like she said towards Children's Park. Oh, towards the the manhole, right? Where Saijima goes in. Yep. Yes, we sound really good in here. Only one way to find out. Oh, it's the fucking squad, hey. This is my multiverse of madness, hein? あんたも彼女に住んでたんなら聞いたことくらいはあるだろう。あのホームレスのたまり場だった西公園の地下のことだよ。どうしてそこへ。数日前、その際の体で、あんたの兄貴らしき人を見かけた。あ、お。昔の
あ、お。説明はとましたお前らは悪い奴には見えないが。まずね、ガリック 3 Gakiyama is the biggest threat. Tanimura is just like deflection Andy, hey? Oh! Oh, Fuck, I can't. Fuck, pack it in, Oh, pack it in. I can't, you silly bastard. <laughs> oh. Fucking deflecting the shit too. Fuck. There he goes. Hey, it's fucking doing it. Oh, sorry, I came out. Oh, yep. Bang. Oh, fuck. Woo. The tank. <laughs> Come on, carry you. Fuck off, Tanimura! Ah! <laughs> oh, Sorry, I came up. Damn it, I tried to get you acting off on him. Oh! Oh! Oh god, oh god, oh god. Jesus Christ, I... Why'd it go so fucking badly? <laughs> oh. Fucking doom, Tanimura, huh? Jesus, boys, I fucking hell. I'm like, can't I... Boys, stop, I fucking hell. I can't stand up. Come on, Kiryu. My tiny mirror is low. Him. The fucking Batista bomb, hey. Oh. 
My timer is like. Oh. I'm experiencing pain. No, I try to get the fucking heat action, but I keep missing. Blech. Jesus, man, fuck. Okay, I'm a camp, I can't, I can't, I'm Bro, I'm already fucking healed sign. Jesus Christ, I'm fucking it. I might have heals, right? Heat. Okay, health, there we go. Thank fuck her. Fuck me, hey. I did burn a big drink just for that last little bit. They only had one health bar each, so you imagine they had multiple. <laughs> oh, hee <laughs> <laughs> hee. Need to find Yasuko san fast. Someone around here must have seen her. Oh, Kiryu-san, never thought I'd run into you down here. Didn't even realize you were back in town. Do I know you? Hey. Much as you know any old homeless guy, I guess. I know you, though. Owe you a lot, in fact. You helped me out down in Purgatory before the Hills Project kicked off. Then there was that whole snaffy with the Dragon Palace. Huh. Well, alright then. By the way, you're gonna need one of these puppies if you want to keep going. A manhole opener. This doohickey here will open any old manhole you come across. So some guy came through earlier, pried the freaking thing open with his bare hands. Already believe my eyes. Inside you, man. Alright. Up you go. You know, those here lie on there, fucking back on their arse this time. Oh god, there's gonna be shit on there. I don't have fucking drinks for this crack, okay? Oh well, let's go. <laughs> now, isn't there a, there's a save point in Purgatory? I'm gonna go save because I can see this going fucking terribly. I think there's one in the gladiator arena. Oh. Hey, aren't you cute, son? Oh. I knew it. It really is you. I've been a fan of yours ever since I saw you fight at the Coliseum. You're awesome. <laughs> I don't mean to be rude, but I know you. Oh, sorry. My name is Surachi. I run a dojo here in Kamarucho. See, a dojo, huh? Is this the guy we were speaking to earlier? Was it like Tanimura went to his dojo or something like that, right? Yes, yeah, it's almost on the verge of closing. This guy named uh, Saijima. Saijima went to the dojo, that's right. I can't remember who went to it. Yeah, it was Saijima. The guy was sleeping in the, in the fucking side, that's right. I'll decide that danger, we're doing fine now. Hmm, Saijima. Yeah. Wait, do you know him? Wow, what a small world. Oh, by the way, if it's not too much of a bother. Would you mind using one of my apprentices as a tag partner? I want my apprentices to gain fighting experience, and I'm sure they'll be more than happy to fight with a legend like you, Kiryu-san. You sure? I was actually just looking for a partner to fight with. You'd be doing me a big favor. No problem at all. I'm happy to be of assistance. After all, you're my idol. But remember, the only apprentices that you can select are the ones who were trained by Sajima-san and became champions. Alright, see you again soon. Peace out. No, fist bump him. 
Kiryu can now use Sudachi Dojo's apprentices as tag partners. Like apprentices, that Saijima has trained in the champions at the front desk and fight in various tag matches with them. That's fun. I'm really just here to save though. I just don't want to get my ass beat now and lose all my progress. Let's go. No drink Andy, hey? Heading into the shit. Alright, question is, is your man still there and has Yasuko been taken? Oh, it feels not going to go well. Uh oh, uh oh. Oh, Jesus, here we go. My man, same. Nothing good, though. And there's the boys. Save immediately after. I was just doing it to be safe in case the saving fucks up again. Chapter 4 Chain of Betrayal. Uh -oh. I'll roll back and you, Serena. <laughs> だ、最近の刑事ってのは、こんなに軟弱になっちまったのか。しかし、まさかこんなとこにあの大先輩がいるなんて思いもしませんでしたよ。ん it has been an eventful few days. Hello. Oh, they went back to Sky Finance, didn't they? Uh -huh. これじゃまた一から いや、ね。実は俺の店、でっかい隠し金庫持っていてね。そこに入れておいた店の金が全部持っていかれちゃってたのよ。ペイン。誰に検察うんというか多分木戸ちゃんに。え木戸ってあの、洗いの兄弟
Can we scope on the ones about? I mean, there's a big ass safe right there. Maybe that's a red herring. What's with the big. Hmm. Hmm. Fuck. Hey X, how's it going? All right. Okay, I'm a, it's not the most safe vault ever. It's just if it's just a button, hey. He's put a passcode on or something. Like Gringotts, huh? Jesus! That's a lot of cash monies. That's why he bought his drop, huh? Does he then rat it out, I guess? Hmm. What do you call... What do you call his assistant again? I'm gonna say Lily, but that's not. Uh, Lily is what he called Yasuko. It's not a Japanese name, is it? It feels like it's like a an English name. Been better, but worse. Well, you're lucky. <laughs> not lucky. You're welcome to hang out here and chill for a bit. Uh, lucky. We're here for another hour or so yet. Yeah, it was a Western issue. What the fuck was it, Ty? Mm, fuck. <laughs> what the fuck was her name, huh? Go on, Naomi, Naomi. Really think that's how it went down? Can't think of any other way. Hannah. Okay, it actually was Jap. It is a Japanese spelt name, but it's, it also has like an English equivalent. <laughs> Ian Hannah Chan are the only people you, two people you knew about the vault. Keto Chan is the only other possibility. What makes you say that? Well, it would certainly wrap things up all nice and neat. Everything would make sense. What do you mean? Not long after Hannah Chan saw him at the office, Keto Chan got hauled up by Hatsushiba boy, clan boys who'd been working with the Shibata. Just walked in and spurred them away. Simple. Clean. What's so strange about that? Western Esh, yeah. Everything. You don't understand if you've seen what Kiro Chan can do in a fight. Go on. Well, it's only been once I've witnessed it myself, but the guy can mop the floor with anyone without even breaking a sweat. He's pretty coy about it, though. So first, you keep all that under wraps. How come? It's better for the family that way. Most likely. Kanemura Enterprises, where Kiro Chan and Arai San work, is a tiny speck under the big Shibata umbrella. Now, your usual Yakuza outfit makes their living off those dramatic displays of strength, but not Kanemura. Why not? Didn't want to stand out, especially with the rat race always tearing his town apart. Guess that's just how he was. It makes sense. It's safer to lay low and just get on with your life than to start bashing heads in. Yup. Kanemura couldn't even afford his juice to the Shibata. Came to me begging for a loan and everything. 
Expanding his turf and inviting competition was probably the last thing on his mind. I'm sure he was more than happy to keep his head down and let Kamarochu be Kamarochu. For sure. That's why Arai San and Kido Chan were so careful not to make any waves. But yeah, Kido Chan's a monster. You think he let himself get kidnapped on purpose then? You bet I do. By the time I got back to the office that day, he was already gone. The place was more of a mess than usual thanks to that struggle. It was convincing, honestly. But one thing stood out to me. Which is what? The order my books were in. Your books? Yep. Kido Chan tossed a bunch of them around, probably to make it look like a fight went down. Cover his tracks, you know. But the ones that were still on the shelf weren't in the right spots for some reason. That's why I knew something was up. Hold on. Your office isn't exactly what I call organized. Not by a long shot. Are you seriously telling me you know where every single book is supposed to be on your shelf? Every single one. Good morning. Wow. Long story short, my old pal Kido Chan pulled a fast one on me. What I really want to know is who keeps a hundred billion in cash just lying around in this day and age? Why not stash it in a bank? Don't trust them. Besides, it's not like any of them paid a decent interest anyway. That much physical money isn't exactly portable though. How did they get it all out? Ask the DA guys who raided my office yesterday. They're the ones who did it. You think they were imposters? Big time. Katsuragi must have sent them over once Kido Chan tipped them off. That would explain it. With the boys we saw outside, right? Lights are cruel, mister, sometimes. For Akiyama, huh? Sure, you get used to the cheating and the backstabbing and the lying in my line of work. When it smacks you in the face of one after another, oof. You seem like you're taking it pretty well, though. Most guys would go into total shock if they lost a hundred grand, let alone a hundred billion. I am in shock. This is me in shock. It's not that big of a deal, I know. Still. Not that big of a deal. I'll just make it all back again. But. Yeah. And hey, the week has had its highlights. Oh yeah? I met you for one, Kiryu-san. That really so special? Of course I am. You're my freaking hero, man. You saved my life. Did I? I think I remember that. Just listen. You know when the Millennium Tire blew up five years ago? When all that cash rained down on the city? Yep, yeah, from the end of the first game, right? That day changed my life. I grabbed as much as I could, cleaned myself up, went from homeless bum to this in particularly new time flat. Practically new time flat. If not for you, I'd still be out in the streets, digging through the trash as I keep myself alive. That's the money you built your business on, huh? Yep. But now that I think about it, that 10 billion was probably the same cash my bank duped me into laundering for them before they had me take the fall. The 10 billion Jingu diverted to the Tojo clan. So, yeah. This all feels kind of personal somehow. If this stuff going down now is linked to that 10 billion, consider me there. Akiyama is in there. It all connects to the first game, huh? This game in particular has been very tied to the, the events of Yakuza 1. I don't know about you guys, but this is starting to feel like fate to me. Almost like we were all destined to end up here. Fate. Hmm. You might just be right. We need to go ahead and find Saijima. We need the, the fourth part. うん、うん、うん。うん。それしかないだろうな。だがどうすればいいんだ。金はすでに葛城のもとにある。やはり奴らの居場所を探して直接攻め込むしかないのか。いや、策はある。お。うん。What's the plan here? Let's go. What the fuck? Is this the book that he got from your man from Okinawa? これ。おきゅ。これって何なんだ。動かぬ証拠というやつだ。うん。おそらく胸方も葛城もこのファイルの行方を追いかけている。これを使えば Yes, draw the might. Draw the might. How'd you end up with this thing, Kiryu? 
Hamazaki gave it to me down in Okinawa. It's a document showing the creation of Penitentiary Number 2 and the expected flow of money into the place. Huh. We look at that. It's got names, amounts, everything. Yeah. It says right here that the 10 billion yen that got transferred from the Tojo to Kyohei Jingu back in 2005 was meant to get passed on to the Metropolitan Police. That's the instant you wrapped in, right, Can you san Right. That missing cash nearly tore the clan apart. And the guy behind it all was a man named Kyohei Jingu, Haruka's father. But there's more. There are notes on here detailing a police plan to release inmates from penitentiary number two and create artificial crime. All to make the police look good. That's one hell of a scoop. No wonder they're so desperate to get it back. This goes public. All their dirty laundry will be out in the open. What's your next move? We try and cut a deal with Katsuragi. I just need to figure out how to get in touch with him. I can help you with that. He and I have talked on the phone before. If you can call from my cell, I'm sure he'll answer. Eh. Mind if I borrow your phone then? Go right ahead. That's right, he was talking to Katsuragi earlier in the game. And they had their little meetings out in public and all. Oh, fuck. Pausers. Katsuragi. じゃないのか。お、俺はキリュってものだ。今分け合って。谷村の電話を借りてお前に電話している。キリュ。うん。まさかあの四代目のキリュカズマさんですか。そうだ。これはこれは驚きです。うん。それで私に何か用でも。最
Don't dishonor the lads, say. Nishiki and Ryuji. Katsuragi's thing, son. No honor, huh? What's the deal, Kiryu? Sounded like you came to some kind of agreement. Yeah, I'm meeting him with a file on the roof of Kamarocho Hills. Tonight at 10. Alone. Alone? But that's insane. You're not actually going through with that baloney, are you? I have to. That's part of the deal. Sounds like I'll be fighting through the entire Ueno Sewa clan to get up there, too. Guy doesn't take any chances once he gets down to business, huh? You sure you still want to go? I'm sure. There's no other way. You say that, but... Let him go if he wants to. Besides, I don't think anything we say is going to change his mind. Isn't that right, Kiri-san? Right. A deal's a deal. Christ, huh? Well, I should probably get going. Be careful out there, Kiryu. I will. Ah. Save up him. We probably have so little money. Compared to the amount of drinks I want to buy, we probably have nowhere near enough money. Let's go. Dirty sim dishes. Head to Kamarucho Hills. He's calling. The florist. Kiri, you, you're on your way to Kamarucho Hills? Why am I not surprised that you knew that? Haha, <laughs> it's all part of the job. Anyway, I know you already know this, but you can get to Kamarucho Hills via the bathroom in West Park. Don't you'll forget that anytime soon. Yeah, thanks, Florist. I know, I know. You did a stupid. What'd you do? The Majima one or a different one? Or the Kiri one? Don't my eyes. Someone wants to play Pachinko 24 7, hey? Sounds awful. Different one. What'd you do? Let's see how many drinks I can actually buy here. Yes, I'm saying. Yes, I'm saying. Um, we have 40. Fuck now. Use one of my bases and forgot to save the file, zone file, before changing it. What's that mean? Getting overread something, did you? Any chance you can revert it now, or is it the perma? Hey, lad. I'm on my way to do some karaoke, don't you fucking borrow me, hey? Get your filthy hands off me. Yo. Fucking Kawamoto, hey? Oh. Nice punch, lad, hey? But nice if I actually hit someone. Our drink? Yes. I got places to be here. Haha. Let's go. Although most of the songs are just fucking clapping, so. 
not even a lot of like singing ones for this. Oh shit, fucking loads, hey? Oh, camera show lullaby. Oh, fucking beaut, hey? Go, oh, say, Mero, my life. Huh? Camera show lullaby, I really like. Three fucking it reactions. Man's having a good time, huh? There's a few songs that already look to have like a high score, so I think we've done them on like. Well, it must have been with Akiyama. So we'll look. We'll mainly go for the ones that we uh, seemingly haven't done yet. Yeah, see, like Akiyama's done like the raindrops one. Machine Gun Kiss. Oh, belt out. Oh, I think this is a singing one. Let's go! <laughs> already know this is a bop. <laughs> I missed a couple there, like, but I like the song. E.G. Sakura 2000 <laughs> is my favorite. Is my favorite. That's from one of the. 
we haven't seen that since like Yakuza yeah, One or something, right? Probably time's up. No, more songs. Yes, more songs. I don't have that much money. We have like four thousand yen. It's like five hundred for like two songs. Belt out. Camera should all by fucking yo, huh? Which one? This one. Not in this game, because it doesn't have a high score. Maybe in a, maybe in a previous game. Camera roof is all about though. Fucking banger. Hey, let's go. This was in a previous game. <laughs> Memory boys at the end. <laughs> the happy smile, huh? <laughs> I'll pick one of the ones we haven't done, one of the clapping ones, just for like our final thing. Um. I think I've heard this one. Maybe on a different character, maybe in a different game or something. Maybe this was the one Haruka sang or something? I don't know. the one the Haruka sang. I had a feeling when I heard it, but he's cheering first all. That was very cute. Which game was that? Was it two or three? It's very wholesome, whatever it was.
It was in three. Okay. Was it in Okinawa they were singing, or was it in Kamurocho? Can't remember. Before you leave from Okinawa. Hmm. Too wholesome, man. The song called I Want to Change Myself. Let me sing. I want to change myself. Back to the three. Wait, apparently you can unlock, so you apparently unlock the song by having Yakuza 3 save data, but here's Haruka singing it. Maybe you get to like, uh, bring Haruka with you later. We haven't been walking around with Haruka yet, have we? Okay, if we get Haruka, we'll have to come back and do the song. Because it's, 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 it's very wholesome with her here. Yeah, get good. Haruka sang it in 3. Yeah, but the, the, the video I saw here was that was in, in 4. So maybe you get to bring her with you in 4 and she can also sing it as well. And apparently you get the song if you have 3 save data because it was a song from 3. But the video has Haruka singing it there so maybe at some stage Haruka comes out and walks around with Kiryu and we can bring her to karaoke again. If so, we shall do it time. Anytime. Anyway, now we have for Purgatory. Or, uh, Kamarusha Hills, right? I'll wait to fight the entirety of the fucking Uenu Sewa clan, hi. Ah! Not gonna go well. Let's go, let's go, let's go, Haruka! Here we go. Head to the riff. All oh, fucking other boys are here already, eh? Boom. Boom. Give me your knife. A big, a big lad thing. Oh, oh. Get away from that guy. Oh. Well, that heat and we'll use it on the big guy. Fuck me, huh? Oh. This guy's getting them down. Doesn't personnel, kid. Huh? Fucking Jimmy, massive health bar, huh? Can't grab him for like heat action or anything. <laughs> Jesus. Oh, 
Fuck man, he hits fucking hard with that. Understandable, of course, it is a sledgehammer. This guy's got a gun! Take him down! Hey, yo! Fucking Fujita, huh? He's approaching slowly! Get my shit there, bye! Bang! Frick him. Huh? He's not really that time. He's still standing. I get it, lad. How you. He'll <laughs> fucking patch those a hell, but fuck me, yeah. Oh, there's a heat action you can get on him on the ground. There you go. Let's go. Camarocho Hills. Looks like I'm gonna have to go through the front. Let's fucking go. Ottens from Doctor Who. <laughs> oh. Ow. Shit. So many people to lock on to him. Get off me, fucking hell. Yes. Oh. Get back. Get Yay! There's another mannequin! Get at <laughs> Oh Ah my fucking head. No, the mannequin! I fucking guard in the time. A bit of a waste of a heat action, like, but you need it mainly for this guy. Oh, ho, ho! mannequin number four. Fucking Nakano Watari. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. The drinks begin, hi. Huh? Fucking blocking Andy, you say? No, stop a sunning. It's like the fucking prison guard all over again, hi. Huh? Lad, I can't. He's fucking still knocking me. Aha. Ow. 
You got some backups? Please. Bro, fucking hell. I'm... Fucking hit the stunning. So why travel in this game compared to compared to the other side? God, increase the ability of quick step. Um, we need like our body stuff's all really good. A lot of style fist attack that employs both body and soul strips enemy of spiritual strength. Pull triangle longer than for a charge kick. All right. Triangle to finishing blow. Counter attack executed after being knocked away. Used to get out of touch stations. Triangle while emitting white energy in midair. All right. Fishing blue circle. Gomaki dodge shot. Attack executed while quick stepping. Oh, that was really good. Take like the step back and boom. Feed up circle when grabbed. Yep. I don't know what that was. Stop, you fucking stunning me. This is just a fucking dude as well. I get the time to charge my punch, eh? Why not next time on Dragon Ball Z, huh? Oh! Bro, I'm going to take two drinks against this one fucking guy, hey? That's fucking stunning shit. Fucking piss me off, man. Bro, stop it! It's that fucking baton weapon. The fucking prison guard had it as well, huh? Just fuck off, lad, huh? Please give me a drink or something. No drinker or something? Nothing, huh? Oh, there's a drink in the corner. Yeah, man's got brass knuckles, huh? Yep. Oh. Got two for him. Man's got multiple health bars. The, the, the bigger guy. Oh. 
looking at Jojo Floride over in the corner there. Fuck you. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, that was a waste of a heat action. Guy was on like five health. Take a drink quick before we die. I want to try my new move, but no one lets me fucking charge it long enough. Let me up. I'm coming up, lads. I approach it. Oh, shit. Uh. Oh, here we go. Ashikagi and that kind of water again. Hi. That's the same fuck guy in the orange. Fucking stun man, time. I need to fucking get all my heat actions on that in the can of water again. Jesus fucking hell, let me out of the corner. Get him. Yes! Yes! Get him again, get him again. No! Bro, why can't- why am I fucking heat acting? Busting him? Oh, you fucker, huh? Stop stunning me! Oh, you cock. Just let me fucking hit you with something. That fucking wap wap stone push. Stop it! <laughs> yeah. Fucking there's a stun again. Hi, right lad, you're fucking. Brrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrr
wasn't even aware. Am I gonna lose my gun as soon as I go upstairs, Sam? No free drinks, Sam? Bro, you need to restock me after every arena has fucking too much shit going on. Uh oh. Suzumiya. Oh god. Man's got popcorn fast, Sam. Oof! More guns. He's got a shotgun! Where's the shotgun? Yes. Gears out time. Base. <laughs> Let me in! Let me in! <laughs> Thank you. Oh! Oh shit. More shotguns. What happened in my one though? Oh shit. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Uh oh, I'm gonna die. There's two men that hit me. Fuck, I can't get doing anything. Fuck! Fuck, I can't get off me. Fuck, I'm sorry. Oh, Jesus, sir. You get fucking grabbed. Stop it. No, lad, don't fucking interfere. How do you get thing going here? Oh. Boys, you need to go too, like, but the fucking guy with the big sawed off shotgun thing. Jesus, fuck me. Oh! Lad, how much fucking ammo do you have on that thing? Stop it. Stop. Stop. Fucker. Batter up! That's what I thought, time. Huh? Here, lad. Oh, Jesus. Oh, fucking hell, there's more of them. Hoop! Fuck it. Give me a wee knife, lad, time. Huh? Hey, oh. I'm taking up time. 
she get me closer to the roof? I can't take the shotgun, can I? Nope. Oh, Jesus. He's got a fucking machine gun. Oh. And like, fuck the, fuck the can at him. I didn't mean to turn my back to him. Boom. Well, sorry, in the, of the fucking machine gun. Hey, where'd it go? No, it despawned. Thomas had never seen such bullshit in his life, eh? Oh, fuck! Hold on, it missed. Oh shit! Let me in. Any free drinks, Ren? They'd be really handy right now. Hopefully the gun hasn't despawned, it didn't want to use it for that fight. Indeed. Oh shit, I walk on Fucking Yep, bang! Of course, fucking two health bar Andy has the weapon. What's that? A wee hammer hang? A cheeky biggy hammer? Oh. Okay. Hmm. Let's go. Need the gun to take this guy out. Bang. Oh. No, I'll take it.
Let me in. Let me in. Shit. Didn't mean to toss it that far. Bang. That guy at the end of a machine gun or a shotgun or something. He's got something anyway. My, where's my gun? Did, they, did I fucking despawn that time? Her. Swordmans. They fucking, they've all got fucking blades. Huh? Oh, oh, what's that sign hidden behind the fucking wall? Not too scary, nobody's sign. Damn it, shit. Bonk. Oh, he's just on the big boys. Hey, Christian. All right, time. Give up. So I can kick you back down, hey. Baba Booey. Play some tennis, say? Did you win? Any drinks here before we progress? Guess not. There we go. Man's hype maybe it's all bad time. Got me. Ow. Cut these lads up, hey. Yep. Get your shit. Fuck. Baba Booey. Gonna go to the gym again. I wouldn't mind going to the gym again if it wasn't fucking like ages away, you know. I enjoyed it while I did it, to an extent. Inventory's full. Well, time to drink something. The game gives you free drinks, take it time. Yes, lad. Boom.
Yeah, I could only go to the gym when I was like between jobs. <laughs> Cause it takes ages to get there, you know. So. Well, it's, like, it's a significant amount of time to get there, you know, not like something I could do on a work day. Yep. Get fuck. I want to pick up one of their weapons and give it a try. They're just baiting them with fucking construction hammers. Get up, lad. Oh. Okay, he actually fucking. Got a wee bit of fight? Haha, <laughs> not really. What are we taking with us? The sword? You're taking their cool, like, spear? Ah, I'll take a spear. Yup! They stole my spirit? Yes, okay. Oh, boy, she dark kind of Oh! Get Oh well, good one lasted. Think darkness is your ally. Dung. If you get my heat back up, we can just like keep wagging to them at once. Yep, I like got. I've stolen your bat. I think I got a gun. He does, I. Any free drinks in here, lads? Around all the bodies, him. Huh? Doing so. Damn, the emergency exit is locked. I need to find the key somewhere. Oh, it's over here, right? Shining on the ground. Key to the camera which holds. Great. The key to the emergency exits. Time to keep moving. Gradually getting higher and higher. Isn't this where we fought Ryuji as well at the end of Yakuza 2? Uh oh. Jesus. Who's this guy? Where'd my gun go? Uh oh, fucking hell, hi. Huh? What does this have? Fucking firing squad, hi? Huh? All like the the elite guys we fought climbing up time. Oh fucking hell! Jesus!
Ah, uh, the gun's there, the gun's there, but I can't, I can't, uh, I can't heal. Fucking hell. Oh. Right. Time to start even the playing field, time. Hands over. Oh. Sledgehammer on him. The green guy in green actually frees me from the stun quicker than I would get it naturally. Oh, I want to get heat action off on him. Oh, he's out? Ow. Freaking Hari here is almost out too. Boom. Just fucking... EG in the river. Scrap, scrap. If I start my combo and he just dodges past me, then the whole fucking thing is just in shambles. Get the heat action off on him. I can't even in initiate the heat action. Fuck, man. Get in the corner. Nope. Oh. Fuck you. These are just the fucking grunts as well. Granted, they're the elite grunts, but it's all. Let him test me to fucking grab him, hey? It was. Oh. My nose is so itchy. I slumber. Better hurry to the roof. Any drinkers? Nope. Okay. Let's go. Uh oh. There it is. Donkey, let's go.
まさか本当にここまで来るとは。ゲームは終わりだ。取引に応じろ。まあいいだろう。約束だからな。俺は男気はないが、人気は守るよ。お前が欲しがっているファイルだ。取引で名前。まあ、せるな。一千億なんて大金、そうそう簡単に運べるもんじゃない。そろそろここに届くはずだ。うんうん。おう。キルお待たせしました。Kiru can dress like Mido. Hey Charlie. Oh my God, Kiru ジャンシビキルナイ。まずは西島康子からだ。あんたはその場から動くんじゃない。人がそっちに行ったら、その女と引き換えにそのファイルを軌道に手渡せ。ファイルの中身を確認したら、西島と1000億をここに置いたまま
He's not taking the money? Nope, oh, yeah, there's our eye. Waiting to make his fucking dramatic entrance, huh? さすが兄貴。兄貴。これを。さすが俺の兄弟分だ。まあ、ファイナル。よくやったな、けど。はい。<笑> ルカズマさんですね。十分なほどにね。ぼやらい。登場会はお前に渡さねえ。何があろうと。俺が食い止めてやる。いいな。いやめよ、ファック。遅すぎるんですよ。あなたはいつも遅すぎる。だからこうなるんです。Get fucking side him out of the bind, Sai. Let him out, Sai. Yes, go. I Of course, he's wearing body armor. Naiyato。結局、お前は誰一人殺せなかった。最低の人間のくせにな。ささいもかわいそうだな。お前みたいな間抜けな苦分を持って。Oof, now. Hmm. Fuck you, Katsuragi. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Oh. Yes, 
ちょっと待っててねヤスコおいお前何してんねんおい Bye, Katsuragi. Oh, yeah, the gun he gave her to protect her, like, yeah. Oh man, Saiji was not having a good time, huh? Damn, part four complete. Big fucking salute, huh? Took out Katsuragi though, who's a big fucking stink, huh? So we've kind of like removed one of our big antagonists. We still have uh, our eye left, obviously, then we still have the police deputy guy. His name keeps escaping my mind. Finale Requiem. Nah. Nah, nah, nah. Can't be doing it for now. Unless. I don't know how. See, when it says finale, it's probably going to be like a whole part. Like, there's still a bit of story left, I assume, so we can't be doing it now, I don't think. So we'll see tomorrow. Or at the end. So I'll get the. Uh, Assassin's Creed downloaded. I imagine it'll be, it'll be it's at least like an hour part or so. So I'll have Assassin's Creed downloaded for tomorrow. If we have time here, we'll jump in. We'll start uh, the um the DLC. All right. Thanks for watching. Huh? We didn't see Majimo. He got arrested on his birthday. Huh? <laughs> All right. Thanks for watching. Sure. I'll be back tomorrow with uh, around our lunchtime slot for the end of Yakuza Four. Let's get it time. That's not even in next games. It's not. Oh, because I was just waiting, waiting for whatever was gonna be freed up, really, for it. It was meant to come in just to the slot, the weekend slot. Sorry. So. Anyway, have a good night. See you later on. Good night. <laughs>